This video is part of a series. Be sure to check out the link in the description to the full playlist, and I recommend watching the previous videos. This video comes as a request from a viewer. Uh, he wants to know how to... Um, he described it as in the credit he what movie he said Spaceballs I think the end credits uh, he described it and it's been years since I've seen Spaceballs but as uh, the end credits go I guess they show you know a video clip of a person then it freezes on them and says their name and then goes on to the next person I can't picture that in Spaceballs but uh, in the 80s that was very common and the first one that came to mind was like the A Team uh, and so I quickly YouTube searched the A-Team to see if I was right, and yeah, that, that seems to be the effect they're probably looking for, and that's what we're going to do today. We're basically, uh, in in the A-Team, you know, they'll show a few clips of a person, and then on the last one, they'll be moving a little bit, and then the fra frame will phrase, and it will say their name. So we're just going to take a clip of me coming in the shot, and at some point, we're going to freeze frame it and add a name. So it's going to be very simple here, and I might hum... Uh, the uh, A Team theme song while doing this. Da 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 da. Of course, that wasn't really humming. But anyway, I'm gonna drag down my clip here. And again, this is just a clip of me, and I just filmed a few seconds ago. I'm gonna walk into the shot here, look around, and then I kind of walk off. But we don't want to get all of that. First of all, let's trim it up so it's just before I come on to shot. I come in and um, and find a shot where you want to freeze it. Funny thing is, a lot of times uh, in those shows, they would freeze it on a blurry frame, which is kind of weird, uh, I think. Anyway, so let's find the shot, like, right there. Maybe I want to freeze it on my shot right there. So I'm going to s go there first, although you can adjust it later on. That's where I want. I'm going to select this clip, and then I'm going to type up here in my effects uh, panel, which might be in the tab here. I'm going to type in freeze. And I will drag that down to here. And automatically, it sets to where you are in the timeline. Now, again, you can adjust where it's going to freeze. Now, you can choose whether it freezes before or after. We want to freeze after in this case. So I come in a shot, I'm moving, and then once we hit that frame, it freezes. It doesn't move anymore. Um, if you want it to be frozen and then they unmove, you would choose the other. But now that we have that, um, before I do anything else, I'm going to drag down my name here and just line it up there so that... Uh, the timing is right, the name comes on, unless I want the name to come on a few seconds later. Uh, so that's it. So now I can press, well, we're going to move these words here in a second. So for a second, I'm just going to turn off that layer by clicking this little film strip here. But our bottom layer is me coming into shot. You could probably take away some of that, that emptiness at the beginning, and then boom, freeze frame, right? Okay, trim up some of this. Um, now what we want... And note that uh, the audio keeps going, so if you don't want the audio for this, be sure to mute the track. Although, if you're doing this in credits, you probably don't have audio, and you probably have all the tracks muted except for your music. Uh, so, But you could select that and say mute, and add that by either dragging or double-clicking it. So this has two effects on it now, the freeze and the mute. Now let's, again, show the second video layer here, which has my name there. It is a PNG with a transparent background, uh, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to now add in a zoom, and I've shown this in previous videos, a position and zoom effect, add that right there, and then I can, you know, drag that wherever I want, although I notice my freeze frame is, uh, how did it get moved? Did I, I must have moved it. Maybe I drugged this bar somewhere, that's not right. Let's go back, no problem. Just go here. I'm going to remove the freeze and re-add it just for ease. It should be frozen at that. Oh, and then again, without adding before or after, it's frozen the whole time, so freeze after. So let's try this again and hit space bar. I come in, I look around, freeze frame in my name. Perfect. So now I can choose this. Yeah, I must have just changed that key frame at some point. And again, you can change it. Anytime you want to select this, you can drag this bar around or adjust the time appropriately there in the clip. And uh, so it's freezing at two, uh, just over two seconds into the actual clip. Not the timeline, but the, uh, the clip itself. Come in, look around. So that is it. Uh, I hope you guys find this useful. Do 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 Anyway, so that's the freeze frame effect. <laughs> freeze frame effect. Um, and, and a composite, which, or 
yeah, I've shown that in previous with doing the text. So I hope uh, I forget the name of the viewer because he asked me this a couple weeks ago and I didn't get around to making this video till now. Uh, I apologize about that, although I I'd explained to him how to do it, so I hope he got it done, and I hope that's the effect he was looking for. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, think about becoming a supporter over at patreon.com forward slash millix1000. There's a link to that in the description, as well as a link to my website, filmsbychris.com. There you can search through all my videos from both my channels. And also, think about, um, if you can't support financially at Patreon, although I do recommend that, I'd appreciate that. Think about sharing, liking, subscribing, and commenting. As always, I hope that you have a great day and all that jazz.